coach, the players coming off the ice and uh, a little more subdued than we've seen after other wins that you've had, even though now it's six in a row. And I think I heard the word, it was a greasy win. Uh, is that how you would describe this win here in St. Louis? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, I didn't think we were very good. We, didn't, we, weren't, uh, we weren't hard enough on our own end. We weren't committed enough. Uh, yeah, offensively, we just we weren't we weren't good. And I, I said after the second period, and we got a big goal by uh, by Marty uh, to keep us in. And Robin was really good. And I just went in and I said we were getting all negative and getting on each other a little bit because we weren't playing our best. And I, I said you know listen guys, we're when we stink we all stink together, and when we win we all win together. So let's just put a period together here and win a hockey game. And uh, let's get the puck north. Let's put some pressure on this, these guys. Let's get some shots on them. I think we had nine shots after two periods. Let's get some net front presence. And, and we started doing that, and we got rewarded. Um, and then the guys, guys hung on, and Robin was real good at the end. A lot of times you refer to that fourth line as an energy line. I know they're known that way around the league. When you're having a game like this and guys are getting on each other, is that also the line that you kind of go to to maybe lift the spirits both on the ice and off the ice for this team? Absolutely. I mean, I thought they were the only line really going tonight. And then uh, I, I made up a line of Komarov, uh, Lee, and uh, Eberle uh, in the third period. And, and I, I, one of the guys said that Lee said, you know what? I'm going to have my best period here because we need it right now. And I, and I wasn't good, you know, for the first two. And, and he did. That line they put three veteran guys together and they, they came to the forefront. And that's why, uh, that's why we have a captain like, uh, like uh, Anders. So uh, real happy for him and, and for the group. And uh, when we don't play our best and you, and you get a win against a team that's been playing pretty well. And they played a real good home game. They didn't give us much room. Their D were, were active. They were grinding us out down low and doing some of those things. And we just found a way. And that's what good teams can do and I think we're becoming a good team or understanding how to win and uh, finding ways to win and uh, you know helping each other out. How vital was it to have those two quick back-to-back -back goals 11 seconds in between because you can tell their bench was rattled as soon as that second one went in. Yeah that was huge I mean that, that gave us a real boost I mean uh, you know you, you you go from being down a goal to up a goal within uh, you know a few seconds it's happened to us a couple times this year and I know what it's done to our bench so uh, you know they, that put a lot of doubt in their mind and, and they had a good push at the end there uh, I give them a lot of credit they they're, they're a good hockey team any concern for Leonard I know we saw him kind of making that last save a couple seconds on the clock and getting up gingerly uh, I, I think he's okay he just he got he got hit uh, obviously up high and got rattled there so um, obviously you might have a little neck strain or what have you but uh, uh, we'll see. He's a big man, and he's uh, he's played very well for us. All right, Coach, thanks so much for your time. Congratulations on the win. Thank you.